Admiral, we caught up them. Emishi pirates. Uh, Emshi pirates on the front. The main force of our fleet is outflanking enemy, which is expected to reach battlefield within 100 standard time units. Well, we don't have to wait for the main force to smash the thieves. Attack! Alright, we'll go and attack this guy down here, and we'll attack uh, this guy over here with our blade. And yeah, I'll leave the view fight on for right now. It's eye candy. This guy, move him over here and attack with our laser gun. It's hard to click on it though when it's got that thing there. There we go. Uh, I've had noticed some of the clicking, some of the hotspots are don't quite work right. Uh, laser gun, attack. will do something similar over here this way and we'll attack with our blades we'll turn this off right now because we've seen it we've seen it to this point Ship. Actually, I don't want to move him. Yeah, I don't want. I don't want to move him. Uh, let's cancel that move and just attack. I think with our beam sphere, it'll it'll hit this guy. Now yeah, let's turn us on for that. It just says it just says bad. We're on fire there. Uh, let's move this guy up here and attack with our two beam spears. Switch them that way and yep, do this. Next turn. Communication channel connected. Hello, everybody. Imperial North Sky Fleet surrounded you. No, is here the last station for us? I am Bonten Maru, leader of the M Imishi. Uh. Yeah, Amishi pirates, kill me and take my head, but please let my brothers go. 
Remember the Lao Yang tribute ship group? After you snatched the cargoes, you sunk all the unarmed crews. You're all scum without huma uh, humanly li lity. humanity. No one can get go. Well, since there are no surrender option, it can only be a fight to death. Even face enemy tenfold of us, we have to fight to the end. Admiral, a large number of unknown biological signals appear on the radar. The number's so huge! The number's so huge! <laughs> what? Well, they just wrecked my face, didn't they? The main force of our fleet completely silent. It's hard to believe that dozens of battleships were all sunk in a flash. There are more unidentified biological signals on the radar. We got kaijus? Space kaijus attacking us? <laughs> what is this monster? That giant beast? I'm afraid its body are huger than hundreds of battleships. That is... The worst one. That's... The terrorist cosmic scourge that had destroyed thousands of stars and hundreds of thousands of warships of our galactic empire ten years ago. Second alien impacts. Admiral, on my calculation, if we do not retreat immediately, our survival probability only 0.001%. Let those pirates be. All ships immediately turn to retreat right out from Lushin area. Lushin area. The main force of North Sky Fleet were sunk. Others had fled. Unbelievable. Ladies and gentlemen, we have been saved from the pursuit of the Imperial Fleet. Leader, leave the Imperial Army be. If we do not evacuate from Lushun area immediately, these cosmic disasters will come to us. It is interesting to witness this event. Ten years ago, the impact of Pale Dragon caused the decline of the Empire, and my country destroyed by the nuclear annihilation. What will this alien impact bring? Now retreats! <laughs> the chaotic times are coming again. Let's make a scene in the future. Or future chore. Future chore. True or. GE 1012, the first alien impact occurred. The giant beast named Pale Dragon ran through the galaxy with millions of monsters followed. Destroyed thousands of worlds of the Empire. The Great Fleet, a fleet of 10,000 warships led by the Emperor Pale Dragon. Though they hit the beast, blah, blah, blah. A vessel of the Empire uh, announced the independence of Prime Minister. Yeah, you know what? I'm not even going to try to read all this. <laughs> it's going by way too fast. You'll just have to look at the screen. I'm sorry. I apologize. Week one, listen to the advice of the commanders or make my own decisions. Um, we'll listen to the advice of the commanders next time. Let's do a direct command this time around so you can see what's uh, in the game. But uh, that also gives me a moment to say exclamation, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to Chaos Sector. I have no, I, I had no idea that this game even existed. Um, it came out on October the 8th. Uh, it just happened to blink up on my radar at some point. Um, since I was, since I'm in a, a sci-fi mood lately, there's been lots of sci-fi games that have just come out recently. And, um, this looked interesting. Uh, as you've already determined, there is, um, a, a less than stellar English translation <laughs> going on here, but it's, uh, it's, uh, doable at least. Um, and it is by Han Jiru. Uh, I hope I pronounced that correctly. And it is currently fully released out on Steam for $13.99 US. And um, it's... I'm not sure how to classify this game. It, it's, it's, a, it's a tactical strategy game, uh, as you've seen from the tactical map there. But it's got... Um, well, it's got all this other stuff here. It's got, uh, if I look at information and we look at the map, we've got this whole sector map and this is like our 
the things that we're under control of. Um, kind of, sort of. And there's three factions. Um, I guess the purple, I think, is the monster faction. And then there's, like, this red faction, which are the pirates. And then there's the North Sky Fleet, um, which is the only one I have unlocked right now. There's Apparently, you can play as other things after you've unlocked them. Um, what I will say, and I, I don't know why they did this, but there is a bunch of achievement spam in the game. Um, when you first start up the game, you start and you you know hit start on, a, on on the campaign. It hits you with like ten achievements right off the bat. There's only forty achievements in the game, so it's not like it's one of those games where it's like, hey, we'll just give you five thousand achievements just for doing anything. But it does throw like ten of them literally at you right off the bat. I don't know why they've done that, but that's. Because literally you have to sit there and wait. Like your next turn button is covered by the achievements constantly po constantly popping up. So you literally have to wait there <laughs> for it to stop before you can go to your next turn in the tactical map. Now, you didn't see it this time around because I already got it. But I just warn you ahead of time that, you know, this is just a, a weird, odd thing that they do. Um, so we have different plants here. We have Li Lang, uh, Liao Yang. Uh, Guaning and uh, Jin Zhao is looks like it's being attacked by monsters. It looks like the, I guess that's the monsters down there. Uh, Ning Wan, uh, Yan, uh, and Maritime, Shanghai, and a few others. These, these actually don't look like there's too many things there to worry about, but um. Toxic smog. That's a hell. That's a hell of a uh, enemy's name right there. They called me. They called me toxic smog, but you can call me smog. Um, so we'll probably go here because this is actually one of the recommendations of our advisors. Uh, but there's also um, things to pump up here. Like we've got a fort here. Here's our income coming in from them. Um, but I wanted to show you, like, if you if you listen to your advisors, you know, you have two advisors and they give you two passive uh, to go forward. Um, you don't get any of these other buttons. That just you just go and do it, and then it moves on to the next week afterwards. Um, so we can attack if we want to. We'll probably do that. Planets. Uh, what's the fort here? We got uh, that. Do I have gold? Uh, minus 1200 gold build manager forts one possible results so it tells you what you can possibly get out of it um, develop we develop this which is another thing that one of our other advisors says to do um, our income could go up by 25 possibly it'll take us 200 gold to do it though um, I don't know what our income we have nine ships I think um, we have 3,000 gold. I don't know what our actual income is per turn. I don't know if it tells me anywhere here. Can I, if I click on this, does that do anything? No. Okay. Here's our fleet. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah. We have nine fleet ships right now. We can go and purchase another one if we want to. Um, and all that costs gold, obviously. Um, probably need that, but the, the thing is, uh, right now my commanders, uh, can't command all this fleet yet. Like, there's a, uh, I forget what they call it, but there's like a, I guess it's the number of personnel they can, they have a, a cap on how many personnel they can actually, um, command in battle until their leadership skills level up. So there's a lot of, surprisingly enough, I'm looking at this, I'm like, man, there's a lot of depth to this thing. It's just, you know, it's just when you, when you, it first hits you with all these kind of weird, you know, like a bad translation plus uh, achievement span and all that stuff. You're like, oh man, this must be, what's what going on here? And then you start to peel back the layers like, oh my God, there's a whole lot going on here. Um, and as far as I know, there's no like tutorial or anything. It just drops you in and says, figure it out, you old SOB <laughs> and I, I, I'm trying um, so technology we have different technologies we can uh, research high output beam 
uh, for a certain amount of gold. High performance shells. Um, we can explore. I don't know what that does. Uh, select the commander to lead a squad for a two week exploratory operation. I don't know. So that would last for two weeks. So whatever commander I pick would be out and doing that. And you can see my commanders have different skills like the AI um, is no battle fog so he can see the entire screen without a um, fog of war I guess um, she's got Scarlet Bride which means she uh, does 20% more damage to pirates um, she's also volunteers so all of our units power recover 30% uh, prestige 5 unlocks. So she's got prestige ranks and stuff. They, they have quick reaction uh, and stuff like that. So Admiral increased 5 leadership to commander. Um, Lance Salvo during this turn of beam sphere damage increased by 60%. Helmsman's ship ship units movement increased by 1. Like I said, there's a lot going on here. Um, you can sabotage. I assume that sabotages their output, I guess, of whatever node you, you target and makes it so that they don't have a, as much income from that, or the enemy doesn't have as much income from it. I'm not exactly sure how that how that works. Again, it doesn't tell you anything, it just kind of just drops you in here. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go uh, attack this one. And we have only three units that we have to worry about, hopefully. So I'll do that, and I'm going to have the AI do it, so I can see where these units are. And, uh, alright, we'll go next. So here, you see, he can only lead up to 28 people, or 28 leadership points, whatever it is, um, and up to 10 units, but we don't even have 10 units, so we don't have to worry about that. Um, what I need uh, is to figure out which ones we want to take. So this one is a... Arbalester, and that is the the shooty guys, the shooty McShooter guys. So you see that's put the four points on there. And then these are the sword guys, the Iron Cavalry, so that's four more. Um, this is the, the submarine, which has stealth and stuff, and it's also got that one beam sphere. Really, it's useful for the stealth. You can fly around and, and get behind people. Now this here, the Tribune, Tribute Ship, I it's got just a supply and repair so I guess this is just a um, supply ship slash repair ship so you can it repairs or, or resupplies your other your other ships I guess uh, most I can figure that one out we've got a cruiser I think we will take the cruiser and uh, we got a battleship. We got a couple battleships, but I'm gonna take those two. So that gets us up to 27. So we're gonna hit, only have five units on this one. Let's go attack. Our army has 60% chance of winning. The extra 10% for our artificial intelligence accumulated big data. Okay. <laughs> he accumulated big data. We'll start to attack the planet Song Shen, my AI has calculated the star map of the whole system. Battle fog has been cleared. All right. So destroy all enemies or occupy prime planet. Our troops all destroyed or is or use more than twenty turns as a fail condition. All right. So yeah, we have the fog of war is lifted as we thought. You can see where their units are. There's only there only be like yeah. There's three units and they're all over here. What is that? Starfort, Starfort, Siren, Iron Beetle, Phoenix. Okay. Alright, got it. Um, you can take over planets too. I don't know exactly how that works. Like I know if I take over this planet, I think it we, we, we win, but you can take over I I believe you can take over these like asteroids, these other planets and stuff. And planetoids, but I I don't know what pal rec and in rec are. <laughs> you know, what I mean? it's like like I said, it just kind of drops you in here. So, um, and then we have this plant over here that doesn't provide any cover. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Then the asteroids provide some cover. Mark 
and I, I assume it the power rec uh, I guess it's power recovery and energy recovery maybe I don't know why there would be power and energy would be two different things but I guess that's all I can think that is is that if I take this over then or if you're stopped here you get that I don't know if I have to take the planet over to get that or if I just if just having somebody here it, on that square works I, I'm not sure I'm really not sure and I don't know what data means either what does that do oh that's just my troop data okay all right, I'm just let's try to get some some kind of information here, um, and then we'll wait. And yeah, you can face that way. Sure. Uh, you are gonna move that way, and then wait. And then I want to get my 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 stealth. Well, he's not stealth. He's my he's my battleship, right? Oh, he's got a radar, right? Um, no, he's my cruiser. Okay. Uh, yep, you just wait. I'll have you move over here. And wait. And then this guy's got the, the stealth and stuff, but I don't need it just yet. Okay, I'll go to the next turn. That's all they did, huh? Alright. Um, there's some asteroids here that we could uh, come at them from. I'd like to get my guys over into there. If we can. Let's get you moving this way. The music is fantastic. Uh, this is my first time actually hearing the music. I was playing it earlier with uh, with my headphones off, so I didn't hear this. This is rather good. Um, yeah, you are going to wait. You are going to this way and then wait. And same with you. I think we did everybody. It will warn me if I don't move everybody, though. Which is also a nice quality of life thing. All right, did he do nothing that turn? He didn't do anything that turn, I guess. Uh, oh, you know what it... Oh, I know what it is. I can't see him anymore because I don't have eyes on him. I got it. Um, probably should use the radar. Let's move this guy over here. And use our radar. Alright, scan around a certain range, found diving units. Energy 10. Alright, I guess. Okay. Didn't really help that much, unfortunately. Just wait, and yeah, you can face that way. Move you over here and have him use his stealth at some point once we get into range. I don't want to waste it yet. Move over here. Let's have you turn that way. Very good. He can't. Oh, he can't move through the asteroids because there's too. They're too dense. Eh, I didn't realize that. Okay, I was gonna have him move through there, through there, but that wasn't gonna. That doesn't work. All right. Yeah. So be it. Okay, we're gonna have these guys move through here. Here, do a little radar sweep. That really didn't help too much, unfortunately. 
These guys are just kind of sitting there waiting. Over here. And have you wait. Nope, we see, see someone coming in. Uh, counter check. So what do they got? 100 power. Um, rot light. Action dodge. Damage 20. Damage none. Hit rate Hit rate 50%. Huh? Um, or I can hit him with my beam spear. What would that do? I like how they calculate like what your chances and all that would be before you even try it. Um, hit rate 70%, damage 24, two times, possibly, um, I have a 70% 70, 70 chance of hitting them, they have a 60% chance, so we'll probably hit each other, um, but I'll do more damage, a lot more damage to them, so that would probably knock their power down quite a bit, um, let's do it, let's, let's, let's take them on, let's go for it, let's go for it. Oh, my thrusters have failed. Huh. And I got toxic smogged. Yeah, one of them one of them missed. <laughs> it it tickles me for some reason that it's just like it just says bad there. Alright, so I was just over this and it's like power recovery and okay. And energy Oh, I see. Power recovery, energy recovery. Alright, so just being over to square gave me those recovery because I saw the line go down and then go back up again. Uh, I do have a thruster failure and toxic smog for two turns it looks like. Alright, that's that's cool. Um, can I... let's... Things here... Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. We don't need to view the fight, let's just, just resolve it. Yep, they missed. Good. All right. Um, this guy has. What does he have on him? He's got a beam sphere and, and a cannon. All right, so we're gonna move you uh, over here, and we're gonna have you do a radar. Actually, probably should have just did the attack, but oh well. Whatever. Let's have you move. There and just wait. Face that way. This way. Uh, I'm gonna move you. You're not moving quite as far or fast as anybody else, but it's all right. Turn that way. percent chance reduce it by 10% if I dodge I can't use my that's all I can do is try to dodge all right let's do it oh and he missed <laughs> how about that okay um, we'll attack with our cannons here uh, attack And he's done for. Cool. All right, now this guy. Move you over here. And have you attack with your beam sphere this way. Uh, what's the defense? 100 on that beam sphere. 90% hit rate. Now let's just see what it looks like. Why not? I love that they actually have this like battle battle view too. <laughs> it's just a big asteroid with a bunch of bunch of cannons on it. Wow. Now 
only took three hits there. These are not going to be easy. I didn't, I didn't actually realize that there were going to be that many cannons on there. I guess I should have realized there were going to be that many cannons on it. Um, have you move over here and wait facing that way. Just have you wait as well. Move into position down here and wait. I do this in like 20 turns, man. We're just burning turns left and right here. Oh, they got some power back, huh? Uh, they have a 35% hit rate, though. So it might behoove me to just. I only have the one. I can do the beam sphere, right? Or I can do the cannon. That's 12 times 3, and this is 25. Be basically, basically just trying to pick them, <laughs> pinprick them a little bit. I got a hit on that. Yeah, this guy is gonna have to, gonna have to retreat, I think. Oh, there you go. Let's have you, have you move back here and retreat a little bit, and uh, wait, facing that way. Alright, you still have thruster failure, but, uh... Oh, you can't move, that's right, because you have a thruster failure. Well, how do I fix the thruster failure? Uh, hmm... I don't know. I don't know how to fix that. Let's actually have this guy... ...down here. Kind of defend them a little bit. Keep those in the asteroids there. And then let's, uh, hmm, let's see how I want to do this. Let's move this guy over here and then wait as well. Make them maybe come to me. Possibly. Not. Okay. Let's see. Uh, if I the beam sphere is three, right? So it'll be one, two. If I just move up one, it'd be one, two, three. I'd, I'd be just in range. Although I don't know if it's more chance to hit the closer I get or not. I would, you would imagine it would be. Um, but if I do stealth. I want to do stealth, I think. Alright. Well, I would have liked to have moved and then do stealth, but I guess I can't do that. Uh, tactics. I don't, what, I don't know what I don't know what this means up here, other than I know there's commands there for targets and all that stuff. We'll command uh, command menu. Um. Move these guys up to try to take on that one thing, but let's have that move here at least. Uh, and wait. See if I can get the, this monster to come after us. This guy come up here and wait. He can't move and he's still hurting, I think. Uh, can I. Is there a place where he can recharge a little bit. My guy's kind of stuck in the area where it, I need somebody to recharge. Um, well, if he comes all the way back here, he could do it. So I'll just have him wait. Uh, right, these guys. Uh, yeah, just have you wait as well. Twenty-five percent against my guys. 
Um, I can't do my laser gun because it's not, they're not in, in range, so we'll just, or not in line with it, so we'll just dodge. Uh, and dodge again. Yeah. Alright. Let's have you up here and attack this guy with your laser guns. 80% chance. Do it. Cool, I got an outflank maneuver on that. Cool, and I'm going to come over here and do the same thing. Attack. Bang, that's done. Alright, I'll just go after this guy. I don't have to worry about those, uh, those things there for a little bit too, but it's alright. Oh, okay, so he's stealth now, and now I can move, and now as I move around, I'm moving around in stealth. Alright. That works for me. Because I have the appear command now. Okay. Right, so... Did waiting give me more energy? It did not. It does not look like it will recharge my energy. I guess I gotta move him back here to get my energy recharged. And again, with this guy, I guess I can't do anything unless I repair those thrusters, which I didn't bring a repair guy with me. Um, that's kind of bonkers. But okay. Shield or dodge? So reduced by 10% shield. Would huh? Energy 15, effect power. Oh, uh, let's just do a dodge. Same with this one. We still took some hits though. All right, let's get you over here. Oop. That's what I want to do. Would you move over here? you to attack your laser gun that thing right there attack it I hit and they missed me alright it looks like he's looking that way so I should be able to do this I hope uh, attack cool and I got my stealth ship down here. I can still keep moving around. Um, we're still not quite in range though. And then this guy, if I can move him back over, over here, is it? Yeah, now I'll get some power recovery and energy recovery. Alright, so we'll wait for that to happen. And this guy, unfortunately, we can't do anything with him, so he's just gonna have to wait. I still, I still love how it's just like bad. <laughs> they just put they the word bad there when, when you have a, a negative thing on you. Um, so 40% hit rate, huh? Got 120 power. Um, but he has no power left? Question mark. There's no power bar here. So let's dodge. Oh, no, he took me out. All right. That's fine. That's just fine. I'll get my I'll get my revenge here. I stab you in the back. Okay. And then I will move over here and I will attack with my beam spear that way oh, I got hit with the toxic smog huh? that's all it was was a toxic smog now our energy is really low unfortunately so 
Do I, is there an energy recovery thing here? No, he's he's standing on the one one energy recovery thing that we can do. All right, how are you doing? You're still recovering, so we'll make you wait. And same with you. All right, onwards. Turn eleven. A 50% hit rate, huh? Um, we're at 114 on the power. Didn't really do a whole lot to them, did I? The beam sphere, it only does 25 damage. Hmm. Alright, well, let's dodge. Didn't do anything. Oh, and now these guys are after us. Wow, that was a balls. <laughs> balls, I say that. Um, let's move behind it and can I capture capture a unit which has power which power less than half or on malfunction. Aliens and forts can't be captured. Okay. Okay, that's interesting. So I could capture units if I, if they weren't aliens, and they had half power. All right, let's go attack. And this guy's gonna have to come into service sooner rather than later here, but I'll let him wait some more. I wish I could do something about this guy here, but ain't nothing I can do right now. Can't, I can't repair that thruster apparently. Um, and attacking's not helping. Not going to help. He's way out of range of everything. So, is what it is. Oh, he completely self healed, huh? That turkey. That turkey completely self healed. Um, let's take power. Energy, effect, power. Um, yeah, let's just try and dodge, I guess. One hit. And we got toxic smog on us. Not great. We'll lose these guys, most definitely. Yep, that's the end of that unit. Fun times. Uh, yeah, wait, uh, cancel that. Um, I guess, are you... Well, you're about as good as you're going to get right now, so let's... Start moving you into position. Yeah, just go to the next turn. I'm guessing there's no way I'm going to be able to draw that enemy out of there. I'm just going to have to do what I can do here. We're almost running out of turns as it is. Oh, he recovered power because he was sitting on that on that freaking note, I guess. Yeah, that's probably what it was. Um, up here. Can I attack? No, I can't. Okay. Um, let's wait, but we'll we'll spin this way so if they attack me, I can see them. The outpost attack me, I mean. There we go. Um, yeah, just dodge. And I still got hit three times. Let's 
Let's move this way. Let's attack with our beam sphere this way. Wait, what? Oh, I selected the thing, but I didn't select the... Very hard to select the actual thing underneath it. There we go. Um, 70% chance of hitting it. I need 25 damage, though. Toxic smog on me. Alright. He <laughs> just completely healed up again, too. Yeah. Um, we're gonna have to fight back with our cannons and stuff here. Let's just do it. Two hits there. And my energy's just my my health is just going down here. This is not this is not gonna work out for us, friends. Not gonna work out for us at all. Okay. Attack. Yep. What was that? What does this say? The power of the artificial intelligence legion. I got some tactics bar. What was that? Quick reaction. Oh, oh! Once that appears, then I can do whatever the special is. Uh, well, that's not going to help. It's not going to help at all because we we have lost this one. Yep, we were defeated quite soundly there. But his leadership went up by one. And we gotta have them do their turns. What are they doing? They're wrecking fort in Noryang. Wreck succeeded in orbit of Noryang. Two fort destroyed. And this hordes is acting. Studying new technologies. Okay. Week two. Let's see, advice of the commanders or make my own decision. Let's listen to the advice of the commanders. What are your suggestions for the plan of our army in this week? Welfare of civilians is the most cherished. Please let me go to development planet Ning Yuan. Let everyone have a more happy life. Okay. According to the results of the calculation, if forces led boy hard shell, led boy, Hard shell. <laughs> We're calling people boys now. Uh, now attack Jin, uh, Jin Zhao. The success rate is very high. Please allow hard shell to do it. So the success rate over there is very high. Oh, there's a lot of monsters there. Interesting. Okay. Now I will select the best plan. Um, let's, uh, let's, I feel like we should develop our plans a little bit more, but I guess, I guess we could attack the planet. Now I have a little bit more information. Take hard shells advice. Do you want to save the game before the campaign? Yes. Let's uh, save over that. Week two. Okay. Attack starts now. Marshall will take command of this army. Um, let's get a one of these guys to repair our our guys. This, this, and that, and that's about all we can do. Army has a sixty percent chance of winning. The extra ten percent for our artificial intelligence accumulate big data. Prestige plus one. All right. Okay, uh, star map of the whole system. Battle fog has been cleared. Right. Destroy all enemy or occupy prime planet. So over there, and warriors and things, and krakens, and sirens. Hmm. Yeah, interesting. 
Interesting, I say. Um, let's go start moving our battleship and stuff over here. Is there a way for me to... The problem is I can't skirt around that way because these guys can't go through the... <laughs> can't go through the asteroids. I have to go through the center here where this nonsense exists. Um, and I don't have any of my flying warrior guys, so it'll make it even more interesting, I'd say. My supply guy can follow in a little bit. A lot more significant moves here. Recovery over here. Keep that in mind. This guy down there and wait. There and wait. Very good. What did they hit me with? So they have 70 power. Um, use their claws. They have a 100% chance of hitting me. So even with dodge, even with dodge, it's, I reduced it by 10% and they're still gonna hit me for most definitely. So if that's the case, then we're just gonna hit back um, 10 times three. Huh? 23 damage on this one or all times three on the cannons. Um, cannons only have a 40% chance of hitting though. These have 60. So I guess this is what we're gonna do. And we missed. <laughs> XCOM, hello XCOM, how are you? Um, attack with our new spear way and yes oof nice nice little outflank there and I've also I'm also sitting over a thing to give me more power back so that's good and oh we can move up here and hit him from the rear too why not One down. Hey, I actually destroyed something for a change. How about them apples? Uh, let's move you over here. And we'll have you wait facing that direction. Also very close to their towers and stuff. Over here and have you wait a little bit. this tower going after us but it's only a 45% chance so we'll just dodge oh. oh and our thrusters failed really come on with that nonsense um you yeah, know we can do is dodge again and we're on fire too so you know hey great but I have that repair guy now so at least we have that going for us. Um, let's attack with this on this guy. Okay, well that was something anyway. Move over here and attack the cannons. significantly better way of doing it. Uh, let's have you wait and spin this way. Oh, I should have had him attack and spin that way. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. 
I'm going to have you move in and try to repair him. What's the, how far? you got to be right next to him. Yeah, I figured. I figured. Um, I'm going to have to be right behind him. Five percent chance. What are they doing? Ten times six. Um, yeah, let's just just try and dodge as much as I can. I took three hits and ten tau. It's, it's hitting me with ten tau. I think that's supposed to be tentacle. Um, hundred percent hit rate, huh? So even the dodge is not going to dodge. Well, that's a that's a thing. And this is another 100% hit rate. Well, I might as well fight back then. We're going to lose this guy. Uh, but not darn thing I can do. Yep, yeah, that, that was a thing. Um, let's move you here. Attack. Uh, with our beam sphere, this guy. All right, and then you are gonna move around this way, and you're gonna do this, pull the same thing on them that they've been pulling on me here. Attack from the rear. There you go guys in closer so they can actually do repairs and stuff. Alright, 35%. Uh, let's dodge. Four of them still hit though. Oh, these are... <laughs> uh, of course. Um, dodge. We have a lot of stuff though. Um, you are going to move over here and you're going to attack this and attack. Good night to you. Um, now the problem is going to be trying to get into, into this place. Um, power. He's got all his power and energy pretty much. So let's move him up here. And let's have him attack and face this way while doing so. Bam! Knock them out. Just one more over there. Uh, let's move these guys over here. And do I have any... Let's see if they can repair... Uh, no malfunctions, okay. Uh, how about supply? Does that work? Okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. Give him all his, basically all his energy back up. That's good. It's very good. Your blood will turn into mine! Draw slasher. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know what that means. Um, 35% chance dodge. Forty-five percent chance dodge. Not doing so great at the whole dodge thing. Alright, let's go. You know what? You are... You need some repairs. We're going to move you back here. I'll have you wait by facing that way. And you move over. And repair... Uh, no, cancel. Um, let's give you... How much power do you have? Let's give you some power, I guess. 
what I need for him to do. What is Battleship plus one? I guess that's that sound I heard before was I'm leveling up, I guess. I need him to move over here, but then he's in range of this. Is there another? There's one over here that he could move over to. Um, to gain some of his health back. In fact, I'm going to have this guy move over there right now. We'll test this out. And this one over there is another one, right? Okay. Let me all draw that out. Or not. As the case may be. Uh, let's not do that yet. Uh, we'll have you move over here and then wait and then have my guy move down here get his, get his energy back I'll have you move over here and wait for our next turn Basically, I gotta let this guy heal up a little bit. He is also really needs to heal up a bunch, but I guess I can move him over here and deal with the the incoming nonsense. Um, do a radar sweep real fast. Okay. Uh, I'll move him over here just so he's in case he needs to supply some, some power to that guy and then you are gonna just wait till next turn now let's just dodge see they're still managing it like two and three hits on me uh, but they're it's still recharging at a faster rate than they can hit me is good. Um, yeah, you're gonna wait again, and you're going to wait again, and you're just gonna move up one, just for the sake of argument. Oh, four hits! Come on! Alright, so I've got my tactic unlocked here. That's 78, huh? So, this. Um, book reaction. I don't. I couldn't read any of that, so I don't know exactly what that does. It was in the menu before, right? Um, move up that way. Move you over here. Wait. Guess it's not abundantly clear. I'm really bad at tactical games. I've always been really bad at tactical games. There's never been a time when I haven't been good. When I have been good. Um, so this does not surprise me. Being this 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 terrible at it. Um, hopefully, it doesn't surprise anybody else either. I'm going to move this way just in case. I know this guy's going to move over and come in behind me. It really doesn't matter which way I go there. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll dodge. Still got freaking hit. <laughs> Alright. You're going to move over here. And attack from the rear. With your beam spear. No, I didn't mean for that to rhyme. Oh, good. We, we inflicted... Oh, it's crippled. Nice. All right. Well, that gets us some, somewhere anyway. You know, it's still healing up a little bit. Is there a another spot along here? No, it's just like one spot on each thing that actually gives you your... Cannons will do. 
better job. Um, so I got five of them. Let's just let's just see. Sixty percent chance. Yep. Score two hits on him. All right. We're slowly wearing them down. Slowly but surely. There it is. Finally. All right. We win a victory. Jin Zhao have been belong to us. <laughs> yep. Oh, and there's another achievement. Sharp blade. Our army occupied the planet Jin Zhao. Heart shell prestige plus two. Heart shell leadership plus three. Our, in, our army has 60% chance of winning. The extra 10% te for artificial intelligence accumulate big data. All right, I don't know why it's telling me that again. Okay, the pirates are acting. Building new units. Wards is acting. Building new technologies. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to need new units myself. Uh, if I go under direct command here. Let's go uh, fleets, go here, I'm in desperate need of units, um, build that guy, build that guy, I could use, what's that, 1430 gold, 2380 for another battleship, uh, I guess we'll build one of these. And that's all we can do right now. Um, finish. So yeah, that's that's my week then, which is building those. Can't do anything more, but go next week. So they are studying new technologies. I should be doing that too, honestly. Building a star fort around the planet uh, Chongjin. Right, direct command. And uh, yeah, we got like technologies to do. Um, administrator. Uh, you see a planetary management. Improve the effect of planetary development by 20%. Beam type weapon damage increased by 10%. Let's study that. I think that should be good. And that's information on our commanders. What are our commanders doing? Um, Prestige 7 on our commander. And then, or our main commander. And then, Jade only has Prestige 1 because that, I haven't used her yet at all. Hard Shell is 4, Leadership 32. Leadership of 27, so really you gotta, you gotta cycle through your leaders and make sure they all get the help they need. And there's a maximum of 50 weeks, so you have to, you have to win in 50 overar, or overarching turns, essentially. Uh, they are attacking our fort. Rex succeeded in orbit of going in one fort destroyed. Great. They're building a star fort around the planet Noriang. All right. Well, I think uh, since we've done five weeks into it, I think I've shown most of, of the game here. There's, as you can see, there's a lot of a lot of depth to it. There's exploring, and I guess the sabotaging is, I guess that's what they mean by it wrecked the base. I think that was they must have launched a sabotage. Um, so <laughs> half the game is is trying to interpret <laughs> the English that's here. Um, but I I think this is. A, a decent look. Let's go. Let's save that just for the sake of saving it. And uh, let's go back to the main menu. And this, my friends, has been Chaos Sector. It is by Han Zhu. Uh, Han Zhu, hopefully. That is how you pronounce that. 
and it is fully released out on Steam, currently $13.99 US. As always, I will leave links down in the description so you can do your own due diligence. Thanks so much for watching, everybody, and I will see you next time.